Hey guys, we're now on our fifth episode. If you're new here, I'm Erica. Welcome to my channel. Today, I'll be unboxing this big baby from Epson. Just like my previous unboxing video, this is also not sponsored. I bought this from Silicon Valley. Just to give you a quick background, this can print up to A3 plus size of photo paper. If I've read it correctly, the Epson L1800 is the world's first A3 plus six color original ink tank system printer. This is capable of printing borderless, high-impact visuals at a very low running cost. I know some of you are asking why I decided to buy this printer. Well, I'm really into photography and I love being photographed, especially in my travels. Each time I visit a country for the first time, I always make sure to take at least one postcard photo and have it framed. I just love collecting memories and high quality photographs. I also love having my best shots framed in 12 by 18 size. For the past three years, I have printed a lot of priceless travel photos. I've been spending a lot of money on photo printing shops. Recently, I've realized that instead of having my photos printed outside, I should just buy my own printer so I can print all I want and see the finished product right away. It usually takes one to two weeks before I get to bring home my photos whenever I have it done in malls and I no longer find it convenient. So yes, my very own A3 Plus photo printer is finally here. Now let me show you my unfinished memory wall. I only have four photos as of the moment and the rest of the missing pictures will be printed today. I am very excited to finally finish this memory wall of mine. I seriously can't wait to see how my finished wall would look like. FYI, I'm not vain. When I was younger, I used to fill my wall with F4 and later on Justin Bieber posters. Now that I'm a grown up, I will be posting my very own photos here. This is my room anyway, I can design it in any way I want.
This is the ink package found inside the box. The colors are light, cyan, yellow, cyan, black, magenta, and light magenta. Next step is to fill the ink tank. We have to properly match the ink color with the tank. The label is found here to avoid confusion. So. Let's see. It's a cyan.
The next step is to connect and plug. Next step is to switch it on. Let's wait until it stops flashing. After that, we have to press this for 3 seconds until it starts flashing. Charging ink takes about 22 minutes. We should wait until the light stays on. Since my laptop does not have a CD drive, I will just download the applications through the Epson website. Now I will be connecting the printer to my laptop using the USB cable. Now we'll be printing the test page using a bond paper. Now we'll start putting in the A3 Plus photo paper for my 12 by 18 photos.
My obsession with high quality photographs got really strong since I started traveling on a regular basis. If you've traveled with me, you know how crazy I am when it comes to photographs. I won't stop nagging until I get that perfect or frame worthy shot. Now you know why. It's simply because I literally intend to have those photos framed. The real reason why I've decided to collect or fill my wall with my best photographs is to remind myself of how blessed I am. Whenever I start feeling down in this difficult time, specifically during this pandemic, I would just look at my wall or my photo albums and see my happy memories. I think that's more than enough to make me believe that life is generally beautiful. Let's not deny that we're all going through a very dark and uncertain point in our lives. The future is not guaranteed. We're all struggling to stay alive and much more to stay positive despite everything that's been happening around the world. So we should all find that drive or thing that would keep us going. In my case, I'm really holding on to my happy memories to keep me sane and optimistic. To everyone else, please do not stop holding on to whatever it is that is keeping you feel alive. We'll get through this. The good, the bad, and the in-betweens, all of these shall pass. One more thing that inspired me to create my very own memory wall is the fact that life is very unpredictable. Accidents happen in the blink of an eye. That's why I wanted to preserve my best memories. During this quarantine period, I re-watched Meteor Garden. The protagonist of that show had amnesia and I imagined myself in that situation. So if one day I do get amnesia, knock on wood, my loved ones would just show me my memory wall and for sure it would spark a lot of memories in my brain. Well, I hope it would be that easy. To sum up this episode, the Epson L1800 is a very good investment, especially for people like me who love collecting framed photographs. The SRP of the printer is 24,990 pesos. The price of the ink is 500 pesos each. It's six colors, so that's a total of 3,000 pesos if you need to refill. The print quality is outstanding. This printer is really worth the price for long-term use. You can actually start your very own photo printing business out of this. So yes, I think I've mentioned everything you need to know about the printer in my memory wall. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I hope to see you again in my future videos. Bye!